<laughs> Hi, I'm Gary Hoey. And right now I wanted to show you one of my favorite Wawa pedals. It's called the Black Cat Moan, made by Rocktron. I don't know if you've heard the pedal yet, but I wanted to explain to you some of the features of the Black Cat Moan and why they call it the Black Cat Moan. Um, right out of the gate, if you look at the foot pedal, it looks like a typical Wawa pedal. Um, but there, there are some controls on each side of it. There's some on this side and there's some on the other side. And I want to start off just showing you the basic pedal you can run without using any of the, the Black Cat function, functions. You can use it as a classic Wawa pedal. Um, you can also change it to normal and you can change it to bass so that if you're a bass player and you want to use it for bass, you can also use it for bass. Um, but running down the controls on this side, there's a knob that's called, it's called moan. And when you adjust the level of this, you can basically add more of the moan or you can add less of the moan, okay? And then there's also a gain control. So you can actually add a level of gain to the moan so it has more distortion and more attack to the note. And if you come back here, there's actually a switch that turns on the moan effect. Uh, and I'll demonstrate that in a second. And then when you come back further, there's a switch that will enable you to have the moan with the traditional wah sound. So you're actually combining, this is a combo sound that you can combine. Um, so if you listen to the pedal without the moan, you can hear it sounds like a traditional. You get your traditional wah wah sounds with some, with some distortion in there. You can get that like. Your typical wah wah effects. Okay. And one way that I like to use my wah wah pedal is sometimes like an equalizer where you set it in one position and you slowly change it to get more of a sweeping effect. Now, I'm going to show you the sound when you kick on the moan. You can actually use your foot and just go like this on the side of the pedal and kick it on. So when I kick on the pedal, now I'm going to add on the moan switch here. Now it lights up green and you can hear the sound. So it's adding a whole lot of attack to the sound as well. If I shut it off, you know how much quieter it gets. You kick on the moan. It's definitely more intense. Okay, now we can add on the combo. Again, you can do it with your foot if you need to. Now the light's going to turn red. Now we kick it on. You hear the combination? There's a, there's a, a lot of attack in the middle of it. To a straight wah wah. And there's also the moan. So cut that off. Off the moan, now you're back to the straight walk. So you could basically think of the think of the of the black cat moan as a pedal that has a built-in distortion unit, and also it's almost like an envelope filter. It's going to add a whole other level to what you do with your wire effects, which I have found can can give you a lot more variety in the sounds that you're trying to get when you are using a wire pedal. Uh, Wawa pedal has definitely become a mainstay for me. A lot of my uh, hit songs that I've had on the radio have used Wawa. You know, be, it, being an instrumentalist, it can definitely help you to add more expression to the notes to make them more vocal. Um, if you haven't tried the Black Cat Moan, you definitely need to get out to a Rocktron dealer. I'm sure you're going to have some great fun with it, and maybe you can make it moan like nobody else can. Good luck. Yeah.